this is jelly baby and jelly baby is a south african social media influencer a rapper and an entertainer with a lot of following and just the other day jelly baby started trending and the reason why she is trending is going to shock you so jelly baby went to a shopping mall and after doing her shopping she met this lady let's call her cashier so jelly baby met this cashier and was processing her groceries for payment and something transpired between jelly baby and the cashier not knowing to jelly baby that someone was recording the video and jelly baby decided to abuse and rain insult on the cashier I have to apologize guys I'm not familiar with the language used in this video so I'll be asking you guys in the comment section to please help me with the interpretation of what was said in this video word by word let me know down below if you understand the language because I'm reporting this out of what I've seen on the X and on TikTok so let me know down below what was said word for word to this cashier and someone was recording it I don't know if it's jelly baby because she's a social media influencer so being a social media influencer you have to be camera ready and you have to go with your camera everywhere so I don't know if it's so if it's her that was recording it or if it's someone else at the mall that was recording it but the video was posted on tiktok and guys the video blew up it blew up and started trending everywhere from facebook tiktok youtube instagram everywhere for the for a couple of days now jelly baby has been trending in all of south africa and guys i have to say jelly baby learned the hard way in this social media age that we live in yes people are gonna bring you up and the same people that brought you up are still the same people that will bring you down if you feel like you are above everybody why am i saying that jelly baby has a lot of followers on tiktok that's the reason why she became an influencer but after that incident transpired sure she started losing followers like you from what i'm hearing she lost at least five hundred thousand followers <coughs> i'm hearing i'm not sure about that but from what i'm hearing she lost a whole lot of followers. and not only that she also lost people she also she lost commercials she lost some sponsors a lot of things and people have been going through her social medias talking badly about her and guys we know one thing about being a social media influencer just one bad news about you and all your sponsors will just leave you like this so for jelly baby she has learned the hard way and uh, i like what she's doing now after everything that transpired with her losing some sponsors and some followers she decided okay let me do some damage control <laughs> Your 
she went back to the more met the cashier lady and uh, they kind of sort things out so i have to say a very big uh, shout out to her and her management for putting everything together and also for the cashier for showing her mercy and forgiving her here you can see in the video two of them hugging it out and uh, taking some pictures so i have to say kudos to jelly baby for knowing when she's wrong and also doing some damage control and uh, the kind of news i heard about the whole the cashier woman is that upon this video trending the more that she works for put her on suspension indefinite suspension i'm not sure how true that is because in a way the customers is always right but when something like this transpires and everybody is leaning towards the cashier seeing her as the victim i wonder why the more they say you know what the best thing to do is to put this lady on suspension but uh, after jelly baby apologized and the woman accepted her apology i think uh, everything has been uh, sorted out and the woman is back to work so i want to, uh, once again i want to say shout out to jelly baby yes we make mistakes in this world yes social media is a big tool that can bring us down and can lift us up but all in all if you learn your lesson do the right thing and uh, be humble that's the only thing i have to say be humble because if you are not people will humble you imagine going from having millions of subscribers to having 500,000 lesser in a couple of seconds so be humble let me know down below in the comment section guys what are your thoughts about all of this jelly baby situation and if you were the cashier would you have forgiven her if she came to you and offered her apology i'll see you guys on the next video have a blessed afternoon bye bye